Sky Kitchen is brought to you by Harvest Market. And back now in the CI Kitchen with our salad extraordinaire, guest chef extraordinaire, Anita Dukeman is here. Okay, so before we make Mandy's dressing, remind everybody what we put into our salad extraordinaire. So many things. So we have our greens, meaning spring greens, romaine. You can put iceberg if you need to, whatever. Just come up with the same combination or quantity, I should say. So it's about four cups of greens. Okay. Okay. Then I put strawberries. I made these great pita chips. Um, which is just baked pita chips with olive oil and salt and pepper. Um, I put in some sesame seeds. I used black and I also used white for um, just a combination. The black are a little crunchier. Uh, what else? Cucumber, carrot, avocado. I remember. Oh, yeah, that. the avocado. avocado. But now we have to make Mandy's dressing. But who is Mandy? Well, Mandy is my new best friend. Oh, really? Yeah, she and her sister. I've never met them. They're in Montreal. <laughs> But I will someday. Um, they have a chain of restaurants that specialize in salads okay. and amazing looking cookies. <clears throat> this is their cookbook. I've been cooking out of it pretty much all COVID season. Yeah. So I've tried probably 75% of the salads. Well, it is all about balance with the salad and the cookies. Yeah. So there you go. Smoothies. That's where I got the idea for the quinoa, to add the quinoa to the salad. I don't know if I mentioned that okay. for the protein. Nice. And so what goes into Mandy's dressing? Well, Mandy puts, <clears throat> of course, our nice vinegar, apple cider vinegar. This is real maple syrup. And I don't know if you remember when I was here one time, Heather, we talked that maple syrup actually has antioxidants yeah. in it. But it is really high in sugar. Okay. Um, Mandy likes a little more than I do. So, <laughs> I mean, I like it. But I probably start with cutting it in half. So I use about a little bit over an eighth okay. of a cup. Then I put some Dijon mustard, some garlic, salt and pepper. And then in the perfect world, you would stir that up and then slowly add that so it emulsifies correctly. Okay. But honestly, I've never seen it not Ooh. emulsify. Whoops. <laughs> Good. <laughs> a little mat there. Yeah. Anyway, and then you know how much I love oh, this yeah. tool. Blend, so blend, I just whip it up. And that's pretty much it. Now, sometimes salads come already with the dressing already in it. Is this the kind of salad where you dress it yourself or you th toss it together? I all? I'm, I'm one of those people that really likes it. Already on? Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah. Okay. I just know some people are really picky and they don't like a lot of salad dressings. They so. don't. But you know what? To each they'll own. learn to like it my way, right? <laughs> I mean, there's, there nothing, there's nothing that unhealthy about it. <laughs> no. And so I have pre-made it. There are okay. several dressings in this book that are just great. So I've made several. I keep them in these bottles. And then okay. depending on what my mood is. Exactly. How, which Mandy you're feeling. Which Mandy I'm feeling. All right. Okay. Well, that looks amazing. So healthy. Ready for summer. Lots of people getting ready, you know, for um, vacations and swimsuit season and all that fun stuff that they want to be looking good for. Hey, why not kick it off with a salad? If you want to connect with Anita and get a copy of all of her recipes, you can um, head to her her blog, connected to ours, CILiving.tv.